Recently, we here at LP33 got an interview with the drummer of the most influential rock band of all time. Ringo Starr talks to us about producing for the first time, being in the studio with a bunch of his pals, and the Beatles rock band game. Check it out. Drums are my passion. That's just the deal. But producing was good. It's like the big thing. Oh, he, re he produced it himself. You know, the playing is just as important. And on one of the tracks, the track I do with Joe Walsh, I play piano, and that, that uh, just blows me away more than all that damn drumming. <laughs> Roll of Paul's records. He's played on several of mine. We hang out, we get together. At that time, I had no idea Paul was going to be on it. He heard Walk With You and he said, oh, I, I think I got something for this. Give me a pair of cans and I'll be on the mic. And then he just did what he did and he enhanced it 100%. The last five records was like, you know, it was Ringo and the Roundheads. Five or six people all the time, so we call them the Roundheads and of course I'm Ringo. So I just called people I knew. You know, I knew Joe and uh, I knew Van Dyke uh, for years. You know, Dave Stewart worked together on the last album. They came over, it was very loose. We did it in the guest house. You know what I mean? We didn't go to any real studios. And so everyone was relaxed and I just loved that atmosphere. Fun part. <laughs> How does it feel to be reaching now third and fourth generations of, of new fans? Oh, it's great. And it's proof that the music is the music not the haircuts, you know what I mean? It's down to the music, those kids don't know us, they've never seen us. As you said, the three generations away from all that hysteria that went on. The Beatles actually make great music. We had great writers, great musicians, and, and there was magic within the whole group, you know, that worked. What do you think of uh, the rock band, the game? I think the game is great. I have think you played the, it? I think the graphics are great. Yeah. <laughs> no, I haven't played it. I've tried, but it, I get too crazy watching that guitar arm and the things coming towards you. And I was like, they gave me a test pressing. You know, and it's like, this big. <laughs> you gotta put it on. Um, and I had a, a turntable in the guest house, so we played it nice. It did actually take me several years to listen to CDs, to listen to digital. It's a very clean sound and it's like an edge missing somewhere. I was wondering who your favorite Beatle is. Oh, well, there's, there's three of them. You know, it depends on the day. Okay, peace and love, brothers and sisters.